everyone. So I wanted to do a bath time video again today. Uh, it's Sunday night and getting ready to take a bath to get ready for the start of another week. Um, even though my week technically doesn't start on Monday. Uh, but I wanted to use the Boog from Blush. This is one of their brand new products for Christmas this year. I showed it in my last haul and it is basically based off of a Swiss tradition uh, out of Switzerland where they put a snowman in a fireplace or in a fireplace or a fire pit and they fill it with fireworks. And then they see however long it's going to take for it to basically explode. And the longer it lasts, it means the better the summer is going to be that next year. So it's really supposed to be a fun bath bomb. It has a lot of different colors, as you can see on the inside of it. Uh, I did use a bubble bar tonight. I used about a half of the Bearded Lady, which is another new product for Christmas this year. The bubbles on this one are not as thick. Normally on a bubble bar, I'm able to move the bubbles from one side of the tub to the other, and they'll all stay down there because uh, they're just really, really thick frothy bubbles. These ones are nice and frothy, but they're lighter. Um, so they're not really cooperating with me on staying on one side of the tub. But they do actually smell really nice. I love the smell of uh, the Bearded Lady so far. It's a very faint, kind of citrusy orange smell, uh, but not like a wake you up smell. It's still relaxing. Uh, the Boog is more of a light herbal smell, so I'm going to use him as well for a nice relaxing but fun bath. And then I have a Mr. Butterball from last Christmas, which is basically the Butterball, but it was bigger and cheaper and amazing. So I'm going to go ahead and throw in Mr. Boog first. And I hope that this works. I'm going to try to move the bubbles over at the same time so you guys can actually see, you know, the coolness of it. Because I, I, this is the first one I've tried. I haven't used the Boog before. All right, so there's the water. I'm going to drop him in. So he's kind of frothing up and these ones are all of the new ones have um, I'm not sure if this one does as well it does have a nice like light herbal smell uh, a lot of the new bath bombs they've came out with this summer have actually pieces of bubble bars or bath melts in them so it's making the bath last a lot longer it's making your bubble you know your bath bombs last a lot longer and it's also what creates this nice frothiness coming out of the bath bomb so that's that here's part of the purple that broke off I always expect these to be like super exciting and like change your color right away and bam, crazy bath bomb and they, they never really are. <laughs> but it is fun. I mean, you can see right there all the little dots that are on it that are all the different colors. So that is pretty and I'm sure throughout the bath they'll probably start releasing because like I said, they are lately, they've been lasting a lot longer in my bath, which is nice because before lush bath bombs, you drop them in like this and they're gone. I'm going to go ahead and drop in my Butterball. So there he goes. And that's just one that's chopped up into three different parts. Butterball is one of my favorites because it has like shea butter and different butters in it. And it is extremely moisturizing for your skin. I absolutely love it. Um, it's not one that you really use by itself, but it's great to go with absolutely any, any bath product whatsoever. Um, it's definitely my favorite. But there's the Boog. So it is pretty. It does have a really nice light herbal scent. Um, I, I know they've said that it's comparable to Geofizz. I don't know if I would agree with that or not. Uh, but it is, you know, it gives off a nice little pretty swirl effect right here. But again, it's not taking over your entire tub. But still a good bath bomb. Um, you know, it might keep going and, and spreading out. I just don't want this video to be really long. Um, the soap I'm using today is right here. This is one of my Mel Sweet Bar soaps. Uh, it's the Starburst before she changed the color. And Starburst is basically her version of Champagne Supernova from Lush. Um, I've gotten a lot of comments lately on her video. I think because she started making videos and people are finding it now. Um... That video that I made on Mel's products was back in, I think, September, when she, like literally the day that she first opened. Uh, so I know that things have improved. I know that her website's improved. I'm, I'm not downing her products. They just didn't give off a lot of lather. But I absolutely love that soap. Um, it's been one of my all-time favorite soaps that I got from her. And I'm actually planning on making a holiday order of her products if you guys are interested in seeing those as well. Um, and I need to do some demos with like her cupcakes. So I only have one. That's why I haven't done it yet. Uh, but let me know if you guys are interested in that. I think you are. And this is the little demo of the Boog. This is all that's left is just three, four, or five little colored dots. Um, you can see it there. So just drop those in little places and I'm sure they'll melt throughout the bath. But that's your demo of the Boog so you can see what that one looks like. Um, and again, there's the bubbles from half of the Bearded Lady. I just used the white half. 
Um, but I'm ready to have a nice relaxing bath. So I hope you guys can take one too and have a great start to your week um, going back to school or work. And I'll talk to all of you very soon. Thank you guys so much for subscribing. And I just look forward to making some more videos for you guys. Thank you so much. Have a great night. Bye.